Crowd is ready as their Dallas guys get set to David. match up between the Atlanta Falcons <laughs> and the Dallas Cowboys. And a good return as he'll be stopped just shy of the 30-yard line. The Cowboys take over first and ten. Well, well, well you better check these stats on GGT because it's a lot different than that. Keep, keep thinking that's the only person that I got on, at the wide receiver position. 45, 45. Mike, 45. You got that 97 speed running, back. <laughs> Here's the first carry for Ezekiel Elliott. Four yards the result on the first well, well, play actually, from scrimmage. Well, actually, only, be, only Bill Lindsey, his, his speed, up, his speed is, is up to a 95 now. It's, it was at a 93, okay. Who's this? Philip Lindsay. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Prescott from the gun. Gonna take a shot for Gallup. And he bats it away, and it falls down incomplete. Michael Gallup, that's who he was looking for. And it'll bring up third down. Well, they've got man coverage on the outside. Uh, he got a uh, double report on these DBs tells me that they love to take matters in their own hands. They want man coverage, not zone. And there was good coverage there that forced the incompletion. This defense looking for an early stop. This is third down and six. Uh, let's see what Cam's on doing. Here's Prescott. Cooper's got it. And they get him down, but not before he takes um, it. I was in a zone, but okay. Give him 10 there, good enough for the first down. I, 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 would, I would definitely, I would definitely in a couple four, so, show three. Yeah, uh, it said you were in a man coverage, stop it. <laughs> man, I was not in a man coverage. A first down carry by Elliott. Look at the spin. And he's able to break out a one tackle, but then quickly brought down. No doubt about it. A really nice job there by the defense, not allowing him to get to the perimeter. But that means your defensive ends, your outside linebackers, the guys that you pay big money to to sack the quarterback, they also have to have interest in the running game as well. And they did a nice job there of holding the point of attack and not giving ground. Second and nine from the 44. Dak dropping this one off for Zeke. And that's going to be good for another first down as the tackle's made Damn. at the Falcons' 43. Yeah, for the game. Are you serious? First down. God damn. First and 10 at the 43-yard line. Jesus fucking Christ. <sighs> Look at this tearing of dominoes. Who did I just say it? That's right, yeah. Alright, we're good. <laughs> From Falcon territory now, here's first and ten at the 43. Out of the gun, it's Elliot. And he's going to be taken down with a marker on the field. I love how you do a hit so stick and then they call a holding after it gets hit. So the big tight end. This game is so broke. <laughs> I, 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 I was thinking, I was thinking, what's the call? <laughs> he hit sticks him and then he called a holding call. I'm dead. They're backed up here with a first and 20 now after the holding penalty. From the shotgun, it's Prescott. Got an open man, it's Michael Gallup. And this time he's able to take it down to the 42. That's a gain of 11, would have been a first down if not for that penalty moments ago. With the Falcons, 42 yard line. Second and nine. Off play action to Elliott, here's Prescott. Thanks, man. Able to That's so gay. 
Get him in stride. I hate Madden so much. Pick out the 25. First and 10 at the 16 yard line. So the ball down to the 16 here for first and 10. From the shotgun again to Elliott. And he's brought down just outside of the 10 at the 11. He'll get a nice chunk there on the first down run, and it's second and four. He was solid last week, over 100 yards in their victory on the ground. They want to get that going again. Absolutely. What they also understand is that from week to week, it's not necessarily the same, but they want it to be, right? What they saw last week on the ground, they want to see in this game as well. On second down, Elliott. And running room hard to come by here. He gets it down to the eight. And he got half of what he needed there, two yards. And it'll bring up a third and two more. Third and two. They'll try and run for it with Elliott. And Elliott trying to work his way forward. But it looks like he did not make it. He needed two, he got one. And that's going to leave him with fourth down at a yard. I should have tagged him inside. I hate when you tag the outside guy as a linebacker, bro. Staying out there. They're going to go for it on fourth. Here we go now with Holdawalla. Oh, boy. Look at this play, Jimmy. Watch this. Jamez Holdawalla. His first touchdown on the year. And the Cowboys take it all the way down the field. And I was not respecting the full back dive. That was a good play. And this is up and good to make it 7 0 Cowboys. Makes the score Cowboys 7. Falcons. Now after the touchdown, it's Zerline. He'll kick it away. That dive should have been blown the fuck up. <laughs> Decision to bring it yeah, out. he so did. Like I said, they should have been there. Uh, nah, he should have killed him in the backfield. But the way they pushed him, I do push him further away, which led me to backside crease. So basically, my whole defense line slanted to the left. And then yeah, yeah, they slanted, right? But the guy covered up the, pulled the block out of the way. The guy that would have killed the block pulled it out of the way. Jordan Love ready on first down here. And he will go down. A Cowboy sack. Jalen Smith in there to get him. And that is sack number six now for him on the year. Okay, partner, a couple points of interest right here, all right? Offensively, we see that they came out throwing the football. But maybe more importantly, the blitz that came defensively. <laughs> Shut up, Jimmy. I'm not. 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 I'm no. Now that screen there on second down certainly didn't develop how they had hoped. Is that one they should have even tried, or is that one the quarterback sticks in his pocket? I think the latter. I like what you said there, because trying is one thing. We can second guess just about every call. But in this case, when you realize that it's broken down, just throw it at the feet of your intended receiver so that no one can pick it off, right? You don't have the ball tipped up in the air, and you come back and try to pick up the first down on third down. That way you don't lose any yardage. Dancing to his left. And now he'll let this one go deep. Back over the middle. Oh, he almost picked it. Nearly a turnover there on their opening drive. And that's a throw he'd like to have back. Now fourth down. Sterling. On fourth down, the Falcons send out Sterling Hoffrichter to punt. Is his receiver actually he jumps? He only asked to punt once in the victory last you know. week as he sends this one away. Officially, that'll be marked His receiver down. actually jumps where ours don't ever jump. The Cowboys are going to take over in great position here with a first and ten. They're coming out with a jumbo package to start the drive. Here's Elliott. Mm. Two yards on the pickup there. It'll be second and eight. Well, any lane that might have been open there was closed pretty quickly, and that was because the defensive front, they won that battle at the point of attack in the line of scrimmage. They used great leverage, held their spot, and stacked him up. I'm not even breathing.
The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. This is Elliott. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. Two See, a lineman is supposed to throw that man out the way. He's supposed to throw that man out the way and go to the linebacker. That's the shit that be bothering him, man. First down marker at the 31. It's third down. Prescott to throw it. And a throw there going to be in. Look at this animation, bro. This is supposed to be a possession to catch it. Look at this animation. Results in a fourth down. <laughs> Cowboys trot out Greg Zerline. This officially a 55 yard attempt. It's supposed to be a possession catch. You see what he does, bro? He has got it from 55. And did you see how he jumped? Like he jumped and held his boards. He did a hop step to position catch it. To kick off for Dallas. Zerline out now to kick this one away. And that's fielded on the back line of the end zone. And he's only going to make it to the 13 yard line and no further. Well, conventional football, football 101, tells us if you don't get it back to the 20 yard line on a kickoff return, that's a disappointment. But some of these team special teams coaches, with approval by the head coach, they give them full authority to go ahead and bring it out and try to be aggressive. Almost what we call the green light, red light thing. Green light means go, red light means stop. Looks like he had green on that play. And that play the... goes nowhere. He's met behind the line, and a penalty flag may add insult to injury. Well, they had stopped him for a loss on the run anyway, so they'll decline that. It's almost a good psychological advantage, isn't it? You created a penalty, and you still couldn't gain yards against us. No way we need to take that one. Now they face a second and long following the holding penalty. No way. No way. And he'll be taken down at the <laughs> that is okay. Gary, <laughs> That's a fumble, bro. More than half of what they That's needed. a fumble. That You're not even getting that at all. That's a really nice job by them picking up the run. That's a fumble, bro. That is not a... You're not getting that play off. It's into a nice run. And a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother it. But a lot of the blitzers, they come in a little bit high. They don't have great leverage, and they're easily blocked and turned to the side. Yeah, the Cowboys here on third down bringing in an extra defensive back. Not to sit in there, shit, bro. That's a bug one now. Love. And that will be incomplete. The passing game not in sync here early. And now it's fourth down. That looks like it's going to be two empty possessions now to start this football game. I think they're going to have to sit down and talk about what worked for them last week in their win. Sometimes you we are have a discussion about this punt rule. Get back to what works. Y'all some cheesy motherfuckers in that shit. Da David, to be honest, to be honest, I'm not, I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to punt it short. Apparently, this punt is punt like he did the other day. No, 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 I, no, I, I hit, I hit the pun all the way up, and this motherfucker gonna kick it short. If this defense wants to stay in this ball game, they've got to start ending some drives. That helps. And they have to look ahead at what they expect the offense to do. And right now, with that lead, that's run the football. So you don't just stack the line of scrimmage. You have to get upfield and try to make some plays in their backfield. Second down, Prescott. And on the left sideline, he caught it, but out of bounds, according to the headlinesman. Incomplete, so the ball a little late getting there, and it's third down. Well, there's times when you see these catches that are made, and we just know the guy's playing it, but really wishing for college rules. Only need that one, one foot down. I know, I would have more second, it would have been tough, no? The, the Cowboys on I've third down. It. Just one for three thus far. This is third and ten. There's Prescott. And all There's the way no way. Inside the 15 before they drop it. Well, that's one way to convert on third down, picking up 26 yards. First good strong throw and catch right there. And so far in this game, 
the alleys have been open for them to get completions, and they're taking advantage of it. On first down, Italian oh, this is down to about the 12 for a this game. Dude is, how did he grab him? I didn't even see a hand go in there. That right there just showed that was all pretty good at animated. That, type of a game, considering that was all computer animated right there. Second and seven. The 12 yard line. You didn't even see a hand come out, did you? Carry. Here's second and seven. That is a touchdown, bro. That's all computer animated. Tenth carry now for Allen. They'll get this down inside the ten for a pickup of about three. The ball carrier. Typically, we think it's the strong safeties that are better tacklers, especially closer to the line of scrimmage amidst traffic. But in this case, how about the free safety coming up and making the big time play? The Cowboys on third down. They've hit two for four thus far. This is third and four. Prescott. And this ball is caught by Lamb. Touchdown, Dallas. C.D. Lamb, his sixth touchdown of the season. And the Cowboys will add on to their lead. A lot of people might call this mm. backyard football. Sometimes just understanding when you've got to go put Michael Gallup on the block for a first. Give him an opportunity to go up and make a play, even when contested. Huh? Looks like that one worked out pretty well. The trust factor, in effect. He's over 90 overall. And that's fielded on the back line. He's like 24. <laughs> And he's probably he, 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 he is in the zone as he can only muster a return to the 14 yard line. For conventional football, football is one tells us if you don't get it back to the 20 yard line, Jimmy, Jimmy just return, talking out his head now. Look, I think he's only like 24, bro. He's not old. Be aggressive, almost what we call the green light, red light theory. Green light means go, red light means stop. Looks like he had green on that play. And all the way down to the 39. Joe Mixon. It's a big play there for Atlanta. He not worth the first. Yards. A gain of well, hello. I mean, it took him a while to get him a rep, but that's quite an introduction to this game. And not just hello. How about goodbye to the defense as he went past him? Big time run on his first carry of the game. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. Back to the ground, this time with Gurley. And a short Look at this guy. This guy didn't even know the run was behind him. He turned around and made the tackle. Just over two yards as the first half clock dips inside of three minutes. Brings up second and eight. Yeah, we see how he did that. That's just so crazy. The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. And he'll lose yardage here. Back at the 41. It's a loss of four. Now third down. This defense is really flown around in the first half. They've gotten to the ball carrier before they can really get started. Offense going to have to come up with something else in order to try and get this running game going. Two minutes remaining in this first half of football. again that we're going to check in with Jonathan Coachman in Orlando. He'll have stats and scores from around the NFL as we reach now, hard to believe, the halfway point of the season. Time flying. It certainly is. Time to get the sweaters out, my man. Aaron it out, looking for Ridley. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked off down near the five. And a terrific return as he'll take it up past the 35. Well, CD, I know it's just his second year in the league as a quarterback, but that's going to be one when he flips on the tape. He's like, ah, I shouldn't have thrown that ball. No doubt about it, and his coaching staff will be emphatic about he shouldn't have thrown that ball. But remember, second year, as you noted, on-the-job training, so he's got to take this feedback that he's getting, negative or otherwise, and turn it into positives moving forward. 
Oh, he threw that too far in. Line. He got a bean there. Look at this, Vander Esch. What the hell? Catch the football and handle that contact, but in this case, maybe a little too much target to hit. That one was. Bro, how am I losing all? Mm. Let me They'll try again from the 36 on second and 10. 45, 45. Throwing Prescott. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. 16 yards, a first down. Now the Cowboys are going to burn the first of their timeouts as they'll get a chance to talk it over after picking up the first down. First down throw for Prescott. And oh, that was a catch. Complete. Too tough to hold on to that one. It's second down. Incomplete. Over the dime look on defense. Two extra defensive backs on the field and covered up essentially every blade of grass. That allowed them to disrupt the play. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. They'll throw again. Prescott. Got his man there complete to Gallup. And that's going to be good for another first down as the tackle's made at the Falcons 33. 15 yards on the play, first down. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. To the air again, Prescott. They'll set up the screen to Elliott. He'll get the first down and more inside the 20. And he's all the way down to the six-yard line. Cowboys. That'll be marked as a 27-yard pickup. Well, that was a beautifully executed screen pass. They let the rushers get upfield and get the escorts in front, meaning the offensive linemen, other blockers out in front. Completed the pass beautifully. So now you've got all... And this ball is caught by Graham. Touchdown, Dallas. Two first-half touchdown passes down for Dak Prescott. And the Cowboys will extend their lead. They have really had their way so far in the first half, but they wanted to continue to build on their lead. They know that no lead is safe in this league, so they decided to try their best to get one more as they headed into the half, and they got it done. They missed one earlier, remember, but this time it gets it to go. Cowboys 23. Falcons nothing. So not much time to speak of remaining in this first half as the kicks away. And this will be a touchback as that sails over the end line. 25 yard line. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. And some dangerous territory. Already down three scores. A three and out here. Or an inability to put any points up. This one might be over by half. Yeah, and what you also have to guard against is calling every play for a big shot downfield. You know, thinking you're going to get all these points back on one drive. You're not. And last time I looked, it's still the first half. I'm not saying you have ultimate patience here. But you also don't have to go ahead and force everything either. Off the play fake, love. Oh, that'll be complete to the caught me. Back Good Gibson. shit. And he's taken I didn't down. get it. I thought and he was flying. Now a timeout taken. Perhaps a Damn, I didn't. I didn't see that other guy coming backside. I thought he was trying to follow in. We'll see. I'd have been up underneath that if I'd have seen that. This offense finding its legs now. Here's another first and ten. Yeah. Love from the gun. And the ball comes out. Love oh. lost it. It's picked up by the Cowboys. Oh, Tristan Hill. Look at that, Tristan. Offensive disaster on the final play of the 
first half. They just had to hold on to the see, ball. See, this, this, this is the reason why I want to play this, this first game. This has been a nightmare for that offense. Defense just dominating them. And when you're picking up the ball, picking up their mistakes, and taking it the other way and putting it in the end zone, that's a defense's dream. They're having that type of a game. Everything that can go wrong has gone wrong for this offensive unit. So we are at halftime here on Holloway. Yeah, no. As we'll get you over to Orlando, where standing by is Jonathan Coachman. He has our EA Sports halftime report. It'll be Falcons football, and they trail here as we get back underway. I have to on stop him here to stop all the momentum. And in hindsight, probably should have taken a knee as he only gets I'll be this damn Cam Jones back to the points on me. I ain't hearing that for the rest of my life. About set to begin their next they gonna, the they gonna tell me Amir Abdullah is the reason he won. First half, one to forget really on both sides of the ball. They gotta find some way to string something together here, don't they? Yeah, they're down big right now. So as you mentioned, trying to find something to string together, get some consistency, something sustained, maybe calm their whole team down and find a way to get back in this one. Yeah, because right now you're down big, you're being shut out. Let's see if this is the drive that kind of kickstarts them. The first down run got five. Here's second and five. Love this time is going to set up to throw it. You're so and gay, Cam. Oh, really you're complete. trash for that. And he'll be corralled right around the 34. Mm. He was held without a catch you, in the first half. You're trash for that, but I give you that. Here, and he also picks up a first down. First thing I remember, they tried to give him the ball and let him run on the last play, but I think the light bulb went off in their play caller's mind, and this time, they get it to him the more conventional way, and it's much more successful as well. Mixon with a first down carry. Two yards on the carry there, it'll be second down. But not a whole lot there. The defense was ready, it looked, for that run pass option. You get the sense that next time he has that opportunity, he may keep it himself and get to the perimeter. He's, Probably he's trash for that, bro. I had to catch that, that off. He almost had to touch that on to that if I wouldn't have seen that. On second and eight. Your shotgun, it's love. He yeah. completes it to Julio Jones. He just did. He just scored a touchdown on touchdown. me again. Do you want to celebrate? Do it again, Cam. I will pull this plug and boot you from this league. His fifth touchdown. What I do? You know what you just did. Do not play me. Yeah. Madden don't like ugly. Of this in the second half, they need a few big plays to go their way. That's one. And no. To get that big play right there. Now you're not moving the ball down. Feel taking time off the clock. That's you're trash right there. He knows that crap. Mm. To continue to try and make a comeback. This is Tony Pollard. And they'll start this drive just across the 30. Pretty nice work on the return. The Cowboys take over first and 10 at their own 31-yard line. The Dallas offense. Right, he's going to do play, play. I want to play. It's fine. I ain't going to boot him. But that promise is not going to happen again. But not just that. They had a great air attack going. Do they stick with it? Where the heck is everybody running to? What the? Oh my fucking god! Why would you change anything? They got to be confident about what they're saying. You must have audible something. There's no way he was already tree running there. I did. That was amazing because that drive went and went. No adjustments and no big plays by the defense to knock the ball away. Line of scrimmage, the 31 as they line up second and ten. They play fake to Elliott. Now Prescott. Oh my God. And the Falcons get there. The Falcons get the sack down and go. That's Grady Jarrett who forced his way through to register the sack. Now Charles dealing with a third and long. They'll have to try to go. They just back let my men go. They just let them go. The bro. Certainly hard to try to establish momentum when all you're doing is going backwards, not protecting the passer, and he gets dumped on his backside. Looking deep in the direction of Cooper. 
Bro, how are they? Your men are not getting back there that fast, dog. Right there on third down, like any defense, you never want to let them get anything started. And that would have been a first down. Instead, you saw the contact on time, no penalty. And before this drive could get wings, it's fourth down. The only punch is that he's not flying backward like that, though, bro. He just, but you see how, that's what I'm saying. You see how they did that? That was a touchdown, bro, but I don't know how you're getting beat back there. Like Amari Cooper, just slow. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. They've got to dig down deep. I mean, they need something right now. Really anything to cling on to. This offense has struggled. Partner, join me in a walk to their locker room at the half, okay? Because I think what we would have seen is an offensive coordinator and his and his assistant coaches getting together with all their positions, then coming together as a group, going over adjustments, and then the head coach coming in and just screaming, wake up. Let's get moving, guys. I'm kind of glad we weren't in there at halftime, actually. <laughs> I mean, you think you might have turned it on us, too? Yeah, but right now, whatever was said hasn't been working. Now this one into the hands of the tight end, Hayden Hurst. And he's able to get this one down to the 40-yard line. 16 yards, a first down. First down. One of the advantages of zone defense, as I remember, is being able to see the play develop in front of you. One of the disadvantages, when they find those levels where they can hit you with it. Sometimes behind the corner and in front of the safety, it makes it tough to defend. Now a throw here to his running back. And brought down, but able to get it to their 30-yard line. They get 10 more there, and I believe that'll be enough for another first down and will. So first and 10 now from the 30. Operating from the gun. Love. Oh, hit as he throws. You got that all? You get the sense that they're saying we're not playing up the way we're capable of. Oh, we're what's deep enough into the game that the early jitters. Look how he tries to throw, bro. That's a fumble now too. Have some sense of continuity and be able to make some of these plays that they have not been doing so far. Uh. Dallas, Texas is the spot. Third quarter inside AT&T Stadium. Glad you're with us. Second and ten. To throw again. Love. They do get a yard there, but only a yard. Leaves him with third and nine looming. And until that point, we haven't seen Julio Jones. That's hard to believe here this yeah, time in the game. Fuck. And no one more frustrated than Julio Jones because receivers feed off of catches. That's their fuel, and that's also their affirmation. And he hasn't been getting much of that in this game, and their team is losing, and he wants to have a better effect on the game. Just the first connection, Ryan to Jones there. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. Who? From the shotgun, Ryan. And that is incomplete. He doesn't have X Factor. He only got Superstar. He was supposed to go to X Factor in our game. But that's one of those plays where it's hard to keep two eyes on the football when you know the contact's coming. I had you under the yardage until that last uh, high reach touchdown. When it flagged on me to try to switch the defense. But you would think could absorb that contact. Still just the third quarter, but they've got to make something happen. I think they know that. They're going for it on fourth. From the gun, Love. That's he caught that? Hurst. And he is into the end zone for a Falcon touchdown. Hayden Hurst. His fourth touchdown on the year. And the Falcons get a bit closer. Now Ryan leading the Falcons up to go for two. They'll let Mixon try to run it in. And he will get into the end zone to cut the lead it's a little bit play like I'm right and now. they decide fairly early here they need the ball back, so here's an onside kick. And 
How? Oh my fucking god! And that's why you have your hands team out there on the field. Those are the best guys ready to make that play. And let's face it, it was executed well. It wasn't a bad kick. It wasn't anything like that. Just that the I mean, I'm down, by, I'm down by a lot of points. I can't come you, back. I'm not that good. very low possibility of getting the ball for the team kicking in an onside kick situation. You're all about the numbers, aren't you? <laughs> I, I, the numbers I swear to God, because three, game three game dudes cut the ball. Worry. I'm like, yeah, I, 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 I just, I, I can't do nothing. It wasn't seven. 10 yards yet. That's the problem trying to kick an onside kick. It doesn't ever usually get 10 yards, and they touch it before it ever gets there. That was 10 yards, David. I, I, I practice on onside kick a lot. Now they set up the screen. That's complete. And he'll be brought down at the 45-yard line. That one, a first down pickup of eight. For a second there, I thought that might break big. Screen pass. Looked like it was coming together. Looked like there was an opening. Still ended up with a solid game. They'll run on first down. Elliott. Solid run on first down. Gain of seven leaves him with a second and three. Get out of ton of success here so far, but you get the I'm feeling so that, that he might be on the verge of popping one. Yeah, even on that one, there was a little bit I of a hole, but closed there quickly at the end. No. No, 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 because I'm playing you late on tonight, so so you, you know exactly how I'm playing right now. No, no, I, I think I think I only used about 30 percent of my uh, time playing. Sports. Okay, keep keep thinking, keep thinking there. You you bet you better you better check the film on YouTube if you want to. You you sure? I think I, I think I think you should, Jimmy. So they'll come up after the gain of seven on a second and three. On play action, Prescott. He's going to let this go. Back of the end zone. Back of the end zone. Could he get his feet down? No, it's incomplete. CD Lamb is intended target. The that was the just out. They're still taking I saw that shit at the last to second. On this lead at all. And to me, it raises the question of what's right in this game nowadays. Do you sit on the ball and run it because you have enough of a lead? God damn it, Deion Jones. It because you always feel like the other team can come back. Extend it. No, you are not getting Third Deion Jones. Turns to first with that five-yard pickup. First and ten at the 33-yard line. Why, why are you trading Patrick Mahomes? I don't understand that. I thought, I thought the contracts were already put in the game already. And he'll lose yardage on the play back. Well, shit, I, 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 ain't, I ain't got cap for him over here. Uh, 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 unless you want to take this Matt Ryan contract off of me. We can do that. I know I do. I do. I was. I didn't understand how it was gonna go. Nothing else. They've already. Like I didn't know how it actually was gonna go. They come up second down. Here's Prescott. Throw the ball. That's a touchdown. There's nobody there. The guy's on his ass and they followed it. I play is good if I can just get enough time to get it go. He gets in there to drop him. And they weren't in zone coverage. They were in man. And each man did his job. And that looked like vintage, old school coverage. Didn't Plays it? a good man play. Man coverage just get it to me the old Raiders team. They had a Hall of Famer at one corner and a Defensive Player of the Year at the other. And they just locked people down. Like, how does that player get Look at this cut, Jimmy. Watch R1, bro. He is exactly beat. Dude, he's like beat, beat and then all of a sudden the guy's there. Bro. The all of a sudden back. he's caught up. They were getting after him, and they tightened down on the receivers and forced the incompletion. 94 speed. There's no way any whole 90 plus overall. Like, can't, it's, can't, it's beat. Can, can't that shift for a 93. Yeah, but you're not catching up when you're beat by five yards already.
About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. Their defense was able to force the punt. That's the good news. But this I is say, still a two-score game. Every time I get in that defense. Drive, and in a relative I knew where you were manner. running. Exactly, which, which is why I switched the play at the last second. Yard line. He was brought down. A big time play there for the Falcons. And even 60 yards. I knew what he was running. I knew what was coming, bro. I went to switch to it. We're already too late to get out of a defense. So that changes things in a big way. Now from all the way down inside the 30, here's first and 10. Now mix it. And so we're to maneuver. <laughs> this is, here comes Madden. Oh, I'm going to have to play like a bitch. Madden gave him all that momentum, all that BS play he did. His fourth touchdown on the year. And the Falcons cut into that lead. Yeah, you're not winning. You'll be mad here in a minute. Nah, I'm just, I'm just trying to make the game close. No, I shouldn't even be close. Love looking to throw it. And this one in. Nah, you about 95. So they went for the two, they don't get a, a very pivotal two point try that does not. You thought it had an, an, an 89 last year. Give me this fucking onside kick, man. Cause y'all tripping. Oh my god, my fucking god. So they touched it before it went 10, and that's obviously not going to help their comeback bid here in the fourth. No, not at all. And they're trying to get something going. See, going this Falcons team there, is, is very different than the one I have in Star Let game. it go 10 before you touch it. No. No, 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 no because I... In that league, I got some cap. They'll run with Elliott. He's brought down at the 34. I missed that run up. That was a touchdown. I missed that run up. Games and at the start of the fourth quarter, we see both teams hold up the four fingers. Four quarters hours. Well, how about this drive? You saw the four fingers for four minute offense, and this offensive line has really hunkered down and established themselves. Now this is where they say, "Put the game on our shoulders. We'll lead the way." Right? No doubt about it. And let me tell you, if you're a running back, all you want to do is get behind those big fellas, have a little vision and find some space. And a solid way to do that on the first play of the drive there. Again, it's Elliott. A pickup of about three yards as he's taken down at the 31. <sighs> Brandon, I've got to think this offensive line has got some smiles on his faces. And, and I know it sounds crazy, but they practiced for this back in training camp. They knew they'd be in situations where it'd be extra defenders in the box coming after them, trying to keep them from locking down a game. Right now, they want to show the world they're up to the challenge. <clears throat> Prescott on third and two. They'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. And they'll get this one down to about the 20-yard line. 11 yards and a Cowboy first down. And looking to put this game on ice in the fourth quarter, but still not afraid to throw it as they show there. You want to play the game with confidence, and they have a guy who's in control right now. Their trigger guy throwing it, they feel just as confident with him doing that as they would if they tried to run the ball and run the clock out. So signs of life in what's been a dormant offense in this second half. Here's first and ten. They go back to Elliott. He's been busy. And he'll take this inside the 20 and down to the 18. Give him a couple on the uh, second and eight. Able to stay in bounds, so the clock keeps rolling. And this defense right now backed up in the red zone. Huh? Another touchdown. It's over. They've got to stand tall quickly. No, not yet. Been in this spot before. Now there's a little bit of desperation. I'm playing like a bitch right now. All you're doing when you're talking to your defensive teammates is first yep. guy there, hold him up. Second, third guy in, rake it the football. Get it out. We've got to create a turnover. That momentum flipped bad and fast. This game's over. Two minutes left to play in this football game here on EA Sports. <sighs> yeah, I, I can't. I came out flat. They, I, I mean, the biggest comeback I ever had in my Madden life was about 25 points. Well, I might have let you get that Madden. I might have let you get that comeback. Till you pull so that bullshit stunt. Possession of the football here as we get your reset. 
And the scoreboard on their side, they're just looking to melt away these final couple of minutes. They put this one in the left hand column. There you go. And now they're inside the 10 as he's brought down at the 9. Nine yards on the play there, and it'll set him up first and goal. First and goal at the nine yard. A good chance now to put this game on ice. This is first and goal. Now Elliott. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Ezekiel Elliott, his fourth touchdown on the year. And the Cowboys, they push out in front further. Well, it'd be real easy to say that they are firmly in control right now, but I'm looking at your face and I'm thinking I've got to be careful with that. Well, it's a two-score game. You're inside of two minutes. I think you can breathe relatively easily now. Yeah, you can, but still, you got to stay vigilant. Can't give up anything cheap and easy. That could put you in some jeopardy. Zerline connects on the extra point, and that'll make this a three-score game now. The lead moves to 17. Now after the touchdown, it's Zerline. He'll kick it away. The Falcons take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. About set to begin their next drive. The Falcons offense at the line. They're down big here late. I don't know. You just one last drive here for pride. Some people like to do that. I remember playing for a guy once we were down huge. And someone said, Coach, what do you want to call? He just waved a hand like, who cares? Let's they get out of here and do something some other time. But some teams like to do something at the end to feel a little bit better yeah. as, they continue, as they continue to move forward. Yeah, probably just want to put this one behind them. We've seen that the deep ball's been a part of their game plan all afternoon, but they've had trouble hooking up on it, unable to successfully find the end zone over the top. An incomplete pass leads to second and 10 from the 25. And he's upended after a gain of two out to the 27. Now the Falcons going to use one of their timeouts as they'll talk it over here before what will be an important third down. Third down. was too good. That one falls incomplete. On fourth down, Love. It's caught, Jones. And he gets this one just shy of the 40, down at the 39. Now, no reason not to try it there, and they do indeed convert on fourth. First down, love to pass. He's going to let it fly. And that is incomplete. He couldn't hold on through the contact. Brings up second down. Incomplete. Now the trials and tribulations of being a quarterback in this league, it's tough. It's got to be wearing on him out there. Well, he has been sacked a number of times. He had an interception, so I'm going to give him a skosh of credit for hanging in there and trying to make something happen, despite the amount of pressure he's been under this entire game. He'll buy some time right. Now a desperation throw deep downfield. And both guys were there, but it falls incomplete. This defense was definitely alert to the possibility of the deep ball, and they were more than ready for it. They've got the lead fourth quarter. Maybe can expect more passes like that downfield. On third down, Love. He's going to let it fly. And that's caught inside the 30. The Falcons going to use the second of their timeouts as they stop it here with just under 40 seconds to go in the game. First down. So now then, the big play has them all the way inside the 30 now, first and 10. Pitching to Mixon. 
And this will be a short gain of three before he's brought down at the 22. He was taken down. Give credit to the defense for stringing that play out. And they gave up no cutback angle. You know he was trying to dart through. No place for him to go. A nice job there, only giving up a three-yard gain. The last run got three. Now here's second and seven. Working out of the gun. Love. And he'll take it into the end zone. Touchdown, Atlanta. Hayden Hurst with his second touchdown of the game and fifth on the year. And the Falcons get a bit closer. A nice throw there by the second-year quarterback. And I don't believe that was the kind of play he would have made as a rookie because usually your rookie season is a continuation of your college days. A lot of one read, and if you don't have it, you just take off and go. Now he's settled in the pocket a little bit more, reading the field and getting to a second and sometimes third progression. That was a nice play. And he's got it for the two-point conversion. So they tack on a pair more here to narrow that deficit a bit further. He scores, but they'll try the onside kick. And this is going to be recovered by the hand team. And that should just about put a capper on this one. They knew they needed a miracle. They had to have that onside kick. They didn't get it. Well, as we knew, even before they put the, the toe to the leather on that one, their chances of getting that done, slim and none. And I do believe we saw Slim just leave the door. <sighs> I think we're down to none. Today's final well, score I know at points in this one you wanted to close your eyes <laughs> because of all the points that were being put on the scoreboard, you're a defensive guy, but it was a fun little track meet, wasn't it? It was, and you know the people who really enjoyed this game? They're the ones that like going to batting practice at the Major League Baseball <laughs> parks, right? Seeing the 14 to 11 game, that sort of deal, that's right up their alley with what we saw in this one. So for Dallas, they'll finish the first half of the schedule dead even at 4-4. Four and four. And they will hit the road next week to take on the New York Giants. Meanwhile, for the Falcons, the loss drops them back to 4-3 and three so far. And they'll be back home next week for a date with the New York Jets. So for Charles Davis and our entire crew, I'm Brandon God. Next game, guess what? Charles and I will be here again. It's the NFL on EA Sports.